Past. Okay. I was doing that thing again. Whatever. Who cares? It's working. All right. So we're live. We got the microphone going that I forgot to set up. I was like all big on making sure the game would run and getting all that going. Spent a decent amount of time troubleshooting fucking Game Pass because it was being a bitch again. Did all that. And fucking forgot to get the microphone running. Me some fucking slack. Gotta be dicks. All right. Also, I'm gassy. All right, so we're gonna be playing Rebel Quest. I don't know if any of you heard of this. I've been playing it off and on, offline for a little bit now. But I love it. It's a great game, and so I thought I'd put some try to put some eyes on it because I do love it. It's a fun game. Our robot, new robot, what's wrong? Please get up, robot. Wait. Okay. I thought she was gonna plug that little handheld thing she did in his chest, and I was like, well, why the fuck would you have a thing that. Anyway. And yes, I played this before, I just forgot. It's been... I reset my shit, swing so start from scratch on stream. Nice to see you finally awake, Guardian. Let me fix that up for you, okay? Okay? Nice. All right, all good now. I'm Max, nice to meet you, big guy. I was gonna wait. I was gonna, wait, the door's opening. It's a ribbit. Things are starting to get serious now. This boss is dangerous, we have to knock him down. Punch them with your badge or jump on their head. Got it. What, what was that thing? Quick, grab this while you can! Oh, you're, you seem a bit young. I'm flattered, but oh, oh, okay. I've your crosshair function. You now have several display settings to do the space. Or... Max is special. I created myself the crosshair is lower to increase the verticality you can perceive. Basic. But well, you know, it's not mine. Uh, we'll do that one. You rock, metalhead! You know I gotta explore the area. Oh, if these tin cans around, I could use your help. Cross the hidden entrance. It's not that fucking hidden, dog. It's a big-ass door. But no worries. We stay in contact. I got your back. I reactivated one of your sleeping system. Beria, it says. I guess you might need this later. Is that, do I have a shield? Or, no, I guess not. I guess it's like a temporary thing. Taking down an enemy drops healing cells, which quickly disappear. Gather and repair a part of your scratch damage or restore a small amount of part of your health. Hero bot repairs all of your scratch damage and restores a part of your health. Level up! Taking down a robot grants you experience. When your experience bar is full, you level up, increasing your power and health. Come here, homie. I got bullets for your face! I mean, they're trying to kill me. That's what the dumb pink hands we're doing here. What are these X's? I guess those are doors we've already come through, or doors that are sealed. Or both. Could they be guarding this weird thing? My penis? Be weird. I don't know why they would guard that. We need a special ability to open this, don't we? Oh, nope, nope, never mind. Ah. Uh, seems like we fixed something here. Open chest, open chest. Uh, I don't know what's what. Oh, I guess we have both. That's cool. Assault SMG! Whee!
sucker, buddy. Uh, looks like there's at least one more left. There he is. It's army base. An EV station? Who the heck installed it here? I don't know. There's a giant fucking hard hat over there. That's weird. Anyway, I should be able to turn it back on if you get close enough. Ooh, yeah. Turn it on. Nah, she's too young for that joke. Never mind. It's back, baby. I robo-quested the fuck out that level. Oh, where'd my SMG go? Some bullshit. I was here last time I played. Girl, why are you gonna talk? Class selector. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. That looks, that looks dope, like an old warrior. I dig it. Anyway, okay. Well, we only have the one, so we're we're we know what class we're playing as. Difficulty. I don't think I'm good enough to be fucking around with difficulty. All right, it's a start game, I guess. I thought Max would have some shit to say to us, but uh, apparently we're not good enough for her right now. Fine, whatever. I didn't want to talk to her anyway. Hold on. I'm gonna send some stuff out on the, the webs. I don't give a fuck about TikTok, dog. Give me a second. Seed, right? Now oh, we gotta fuck it. I could F around with that, or I could just go over here real quick. Give me a second. I'm putting a link in the extra life page. Not that anyone from extra life ever comes to watch my, my, my shit, but you know, whatever. Fine. Maybe maybe this will be the day where they're like, oh, hey, that Talos guy. I remember him from the ELU. And they show up. We never know. We never know, right? Uh, don't read anything, don't read it, it's not for you, it's not for you, it's fine, oh god, okay. There are extra life streams, there we go.
Oh baby, then you know my thoughts are real. Wait, no. That's just lazy. I'm sorry. That was terrible. I was trying for something there. I just, I didn't, I didn't pull it off. That was on me. That's terrible. Well, anyway, back to the game. I love this game. All right, buddy, this is my first time exploring it. There and with those nasty bots around, I'm glad you're with me. Archibus. Archibus? I'm not sure how you pronounce the Q. Shot him right in his fargan eye hole. Oh, this is a shotgun. I was trying to treat it like that. Apparently, it's more of a sniper. It feels cheap, but you know, whatever. We'll deal with it. Another one of these secret areas. Say secret areas. It's you know, blatantly obvious. Plus, if you look on the mini map, it's purple. <laughs> Real easy to see, but it's secret. Shh, don't tell anybody. Probably a terrible idea, but my god, it looks fun. <laughs> Slice and dice. Just call me Denji. Where are my friends? I wish to play. Mario stomped him with a chainsaw. Oh, they're all dead. That was having fun. Alright, let's see what this new perk thing's all about. Thanks, space! Well, safety bubble is active. Repair is focusing near scratch damage. the key. Light machine gun. Should we switch? I mean... Chainsaw sounds... Eh, fuck it. We'll play a chainsaw. It'll just be fun. Well, it's locked doors. It seems like we need some sort of keys to open them. Well, thanks. I figured that out by just looking at them. Uh, Cycloon! Oh, uh, we need things to purchase that. We don't have so... Body. Data log unlocked. Oasis. All right, let's go. I think this is where we need to go. Yep. All right, the chance sounds pretty fun. Oh, said so not everything dead. I thought we popped everything. Looks like all the doors are still locked, though, so I guess something's gotta be alive here somewhere, right? Farts! Big, bleeding farts. And if your bleeding farts progress for longer than four hours, make sure to check your position. What, you have to reload the chainsaw? <laughs> Bad idea to keep rocking this chainsaw, but you know what? I'm having 
fun, and I get the feeling it's at least moderately amusing for you guys, so. Progress be damned! I am first and foremost an entertainer! Buddy, I need those. I need a better I need to switch guns actually. We're getting, we're getting pretty messed up. Oh, oh god. Oh, I'm so very badly burned. <laughs> to the oasis! Rank A. Fuck yeah, baby. Give me all that A. Torpedo gun. That sounds dumb. Let's try it out. Thanks, buddy. Uh, what you up to, dog? I want to upgrade this weapon, though. I want to switch this weapon. All right, let's go. I think we're in an area where there's a boss fight. Getting shot. Can we, can we get that working on, please? That'd be that'd be swell. That'd be swell. Let's see what our new upgrades be.
It seems to be spreading all over the lands. I have no idea what she's talking about. We got the ruins key. Uh, increases damage by 10% as flying enemies. Cool. That's I wanted a different gun, but yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Under construction, okay. Pretty clear. down, bub? You want down? Total wrench is nine. Turn my AC down real quick. Because it's hot as hell. This is down to 73. Did I? That may I turn it down as other and says not time to cool yet. All right. <laughs> uh, can I get do anything here? Is that? Do you want to talk yet? All right. Well, whatever. I guess. Uh. Don't get too greedy, a mistake can quickly happen. What the fart? And sure, I'll try it. Sounds weird, but okay. Keep 
this gun or not. It's kind of cool. I guess let's just go see what's available. Hey, Vanda! What the fuck? I ain't no house. Let's do this one. Well, last one answered. So we just got whatever that was. Don't have the heavy weapon thing on them. Let's try the light machine gun since we haven't played with it yet. break myself up, but you know, whatever. Oh, a shotgun. I think I'm gonna stick with the light machine gun, though. I don't need his services this time. Three seconds. Go this way. Yeah, this is definitely the way we go. Hell yeah, we got that new upgrade. Get time to look at it soon. That's our end of level. Go to kill everything though, so we can get max level of experience, you know. Let's go to the OSS. Oh, we got another. Oh, we got five stars. That's a bit. And break. Or are we back from break? I don't think. I think that was break starting. Oh, whatever.
Yeah, baby! I'm the only person playing! What? what? That break's just now starting? What the fuck? Anyway, whatever. I'm gonna go brag on my Discord. Where Where is my Discord? I think nobody uses it but me, really. I have my wife occasionally. I'm basically waiting out the ad break. I don't know why, but I am. Dog. Put me back in bed. Put me now. So you're here to tell me, or you're gonna wander off. You, bud, I don't care. And he walks that first no pull. Okay. He's blind. Upgrade, I forgot about it. I'll try to better help you this time. Okay. I have an alt fire. Is that just not on this gun or? Are these per permanent? Because, like, the blue thing is really hard to acquire. That's why I'm wondering, like, are they permanent from playthrough to playthrough, or do you, you know? Whatever, doesn't matter. Let's go. That shit, I hate that shit. It uh, reverts to your buttons. It's very annoying. I do not like it. But we put shots in that dude, and also, more importantly, we know where he is now. So.
have going on. Alright, we're back over 200 pounds. That's a positive in my book. Uh, I'm checking these arrows, just trying to see where our fucking opponents are. And I, I think. Let's try going this way. Let's see if we can find a better weapon. I've not been at all disappointed in our LMG, but, you know, there's not so better if I press play with right. Check that shit out. salad and the uh, plates for you. Cool. Yep. They just punched my e-cig on my keyboard. Dope. All right. Where are we at? Where are we doing? All right. Purple room. Purple room. Purple room. That seems unfair. Uh, I hit a little. It's fine. Fire launcher. Fire damage. Lower to fire. Fuck it, let's try it out. It's our thing, right? We're trying new things. For funsies. Because we're learning. I had something on my Twitch page just changed. I was trying to see what. And I still don't know, so that's fine. Whatever. Okay, I'm making sure it's not like a, an alert. Like, someone that was writing you any of that nonsense. I should have alerts that play off, but I'm bad at my job, so I don't know if they would work properly, so just want to make sure. A smaller team with a lot of talent, by the way. A smaller team that... Y'all you know, are ballers. Y'all are ballers. I'm digging the shit out of your work. Thank you so much for it. I hope you all become very successful in the future. short period of time, but for now, victory seven. something out of it than that. Okay, so I'm not the best at aiming this weapon, but it is, it is, it is a fun weapon. Got a little bit of spur damage here. I just took a ton of hits there. Shite. Duck back and hide and back in it, my friends. 
Uh, we got a hacker somewhere. I do not like the bloody hackers. I do not. They're kind of jack wagons. I wasn't paying enough attention to my health there at the end. I think we almost got through it though. We almost got to the Oasis boss. <sighs> Alright, well, we still don't appear to have much we can do here, so I guess, uh, back into it. Screw it, let's see. Bounce out of my game real quick. I just want to check on some Steef. Want to check on some Steef? Yeah. Don't win offline. All right, let's go. Don't, don't. Blast SMG! I've never used this one for us. Let's see if it's any good. Oh, you jerk wagon. You done shot me in my titties. You know what's great about being a small streamer and playing little indie games like this? Every once in a while, if you get super lucky, the developer notices you playing their game, and they pop by and just be like, Hey, what's up, man? It's, it's I don't know, kind of cool to be able to sit there and talk to the developer, you know what I'm saying? Get their support. Fun. I haven't had that happen to me in a long time, but when it does happen, it's super fucking chill. It's like, hey, what's up, man? Ah! Grandma shotgun, it's fantastic! It's not common or uncommon, maybe it's fantastic! High damage. Grab it, grab it, let's go have fun. Whee! Level up! Alright, what perks we got available? Solar panel! Reduces safety bubble cooldown by 10%. Alright, so we have focusing on melees and Mario stomping people. Don't take them that. Uh, the junk beam. Oh, come on, don't even compare to Grandma Shotgun. Uh, well, that's actually not the way I've ever heard it. The way I heard it was actually the bigger they are, the harder they hit. I, mine seems more accurate. All right. Oh, power cells are only for a single run. We have to remember that for the future. Okay, so when we get them, we need to spend them. It's funny that they're only like a spy bot. <laughs> it's double barrel, they load two shells now, but we get like what? Oh, we get 12 shots. Oh, shit.
Power cell. friends gaining levels and taking bloody names what the fuck's it do while line breaker's active i don't know what that is with that one because I know what it is. I don't know what line breaker is, so I honestly have no idea. Fuck you with the S! That's the highest score we've ever gotten. I'm proud of that. I'm proud of that. We're S. We are the shit. That's how I interpret S rank. This game a lot now because like star whatever i was playing it's a super lot of fun but uh um what's that i'm not i forgot shit Oh, Starfield. It's a lot of fun. There's a shit ton of people playing it. You know what I'm saying? Like, including, like, big names. I'm never gonna fucking compete there. I'm literally the only dude playing this game. I mean, it kind of sucks because, like, I want to play Starfield. And I don't have a lot of off-screen time, but, like, no one's playing this game. If I'm ever gonna get anywhere, this seems like the place to fucking do it, you know? Oh shit, we're getting targeted by someone else. I thought it was the last one. I'll see. Let's go to the purple space, see if they have anything better than Grandma Shotgun. I have doubts. As much as I am typically not a shotgun user, this, this thing's pretty fucking baller. Seems 
shitty. Oh. Oh, fuck. Ow, 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 ow. God damn it! Get on the platform, you ass! No, fuck it, I'm out! <laughs> I don't care anymore! Yeah, we're gonna ignore it, because I'm sucking at this and I don't want to fucking die here. Alright, moving on. Let's kill shit and get our health back. I didn't even see him. I thought we were already clear. Thing means we need a new ability we don't have. One of these days I'll remember. Alright, let's go. This looks dangerous. We better be careful from there on. You're on? Wouldn't that be? Whatever. Whatever. Octopus Blotch. We're getting close to a boss fight now. That's a log unlocked. Oh, is that good? Is that? I don't know. Whatever. It's fine. Adjust the wrenches. I guess is my question. I'm 
sure we're close to a boss. God, we cleared it. Woo! Sniper. It's a four star and it still has lower damage output than my fucking grandma shotgun. I don't I don't know though, like grandma shotgun's been so fucking baller. Like can I can I buy it instead of the handgun? Is that a possibility? Oh I can't. Oh no. Yeah, 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 we'll do that. That's fine. This reinforced door is pretty well guarded. I guess there's some kind of hotspot for them. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is banging your mom. Alright, let's see what the boss is. Diggy Mo! Also, my ad is about to start. So I picked a terrible time to start this boss fight. I guess the boss fight's gonna be fucking paywall. either, and I'm asking too late for it to fucking matter, so, oh shit. Oh, suck a bag of dicks, you motherfucker, diggy moles of bitch. We got Diggy Mole! I'm afraid to fucking move. Rank A! I'll take it. <laughs> Chablam! I guess I. Hey, what do you have there? <laughs> Let's see. You're sticking your nose where it doesn't belong, human maggot. I get seriously. A couple more seconds. Ah, uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, we're checking out a map, y'all. Whoa. Um, eight. That's one big door. I'm um, open sesame. 
the way, it actually worked. I always wanted to say that. Why? Come on, let's go. I gotta see what's in there. My underwear drawer. Here's so no one sees the skid marks. Sorry. First one to keep going from the boss, huh? These damn tin cans were harvesting food here all along while we're starving in the desert! Why do they need food? They're robots. Dual blast guns! Uh, we will take those over the blast sniper just to try them out. Yeah! The two star now? Yeah, it is. Man, we got so many ranches. I don't know what to do with them, but we got so many ranches. I'm gonna grab a drink before we start the next section. Feel free to like, you know, hang out and talk amongst yourselves. Maybe share some notes on like stuff and Jones got, I don't know. I'll be right back. Oh buddy, you wanna get back in bed? Very annoying, you know that? First one up, then one down. What's our new upgrade? Bonk Bubble! Yeah, I don't know who the fuck a head bonk is, so... Shit! Ah, you dick punk! 
monk that wears ceremonial robes, I guess? I don't know. I got nothing. Ass. And titties. Ass, ass, and titties. I don't trust nothing no more. Davis. All right, well, I think we made it through that section. I just want to upgrade Grandma's shotgun a couple more times, make it like a three or four star. I think it'd be, I think we're pretty baller. Little pistols are all right. That they'd be better if the rate of fire wasn't like half the speed of smell, you know. See what's in our little weapons vault here. I'm assuming we can actually get through this one. Oh, suck a bag of dicks, man. What I do to you, game? But we fucking made it. Those are power gloves. Are we getting sponsored by Nintendo now? I want to try the power gloves. Now seems like a bad time. <laughs> There's just so much shit out there. That big flying bitch seems like a, a, a real a real good reason not to try him yet. If I froze him, I feel like he should fall out of the sky. Maybe that's just me. Being selfish, but, you know. Okay, he's dead. Make it to the exit. I found another weird lock over there. I guess we need some kind of specific pass to open it up. Mm, girl, I'll pass your mama. Uh, we don't have enough. Taking damage increases your movement speed and your fire rate by 10% for 6 seconds. That was out of frog prince. You need the key. Don't fucking judge me. It sucks though, because we can see the other key in there. The key for one of the older, older areas. And a health drone that I desperately fucking need. Oh, fuck! We can't go back. We can't go back. We're stuck here. Alright. Your 
precious health. I need your blood candies, my friend. Oh, this almost sucks. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna go back. Get back and do it all over, but I can't go back, I know. Close quota, sure. Let's go. All right, so we are. Severely fucking injured and have very low chance of survival here. Oh, there's nothing left to do. Oh shit, that's the exit. That's the exit, isn't it? Did we, did we make it? Are we good? Please tell me we're good. I would like to be good, please. Ah, fuck a go! Oh, that motherfucker's healing. That ain't right. <laughs> That was a good run, though. We killed a boss. We got pretty deep in. I'd, I'd say we can be proud of that one, right? You can never leave. Yeah, that's capitalism. I know that's not what you were going for, but that's where I'm taking it. What's up, dip? Uh, teleport eight meters forward and generate three charges. Trigger an explosion apply high factory room. Fuck it. Fuck it, let's try them out, right? Uh, when do we unlock the next ones? Locked by base camp level 4. I don't know how to upgrade the base camp. Uh, destroying a thousand enemies. We're getting close to that one. And we gotta find the lost job one. I don't I don't even know how the fuck to do that. Upgrade base camp. Well, there we go. Oh, that's what I do with wrenches. Huh. Okay. Oh, we, oh we, yeah, we got quite a few, actually. Uh, power cell bank. Gadget bundle. Do we unlock the next level? There we go. I'll see. Max chest contains one additional weapon choice. 5% additional chance to have an alt fire. I don't particularly care about that. Yeah, none of this looks particularly entertaining to me. Go on. All right, let's go back to it. It's not gonna talk to me, are you? Big dummy! Just trying out our, our new bot. Alright, let's try the ruins. We're starting all the way back here. Let's just go to the ruins. We haven't done anything there yet, and we've already unlocked it. Maybe that'll give us the key we need for the other path. Mortar, ice cannon, or sawed off. So let's do the, the ice cannon. That was pretty fun.
I wonder if I can use this to reach that high area. Yeah, the, the area in the brown place so we've not been able to reach yet. And I wonder if I can use the teleport to get up there. I assume it was like a, a skill we have to get to be a boss or some shit. Maybe not. Maybe it's just a different time. Ooh. Be fair, I often forget I have a second one, that's not bad. Hey! Hey! Motherfucker, I was trying to smoke. Messed up. Mine got. Eh, we'll try it out, why not? Boop, boop. I thought, okay, this seems like a terrible idea. I'm probably gonna fucking hate this weapon. And it'll probably lead to a super short playthrough, but, you know, we're gonna try it anyway. It's just a weapon where I have to then trigger the effect of the weapon. Seems like an unnecessary added step, you know what I'm saying? Fine. Sounds awful too, but whatever. I didn't say, huh? Nerp, nerp, let's go to the ruins! Anyway, so this is a, a game, for, uh, it's in early release still apparently, from a smaller developer, and, and I like supporting the little guy. And this game is actually a fuck ton of fun, so I highly recommend everyone go check it out. Give the smaller developers their, uh, you know, their due. You know, we appreciate the work. healing it there because I got stuck on the fucking <laughs> high wire and couldn't get down. Ah, well, that was funny. It was worth it. Let's go! ourselves new upgrade y'all Touch up this nail real quick. Every time just one nail is supposed to be a bitch. This time it's my ring finger. But they're getting a drink and it got all smudgy and I'd like you know do that thing where you press your nail polish back into place. Very annoyed. I'm gonna see if I can try to recover it without having to like strip it and re completely redo it. Uh 
Uh, let's see what we got here. Increases shock damage 20%. I don't have any shock damage. Junk beam or windmill rifle. Riffle. Riffle. We can put a junk beam. Yeah, let's do that. What lost city? Bows, 54, 50.4 54 damage. Eh. I'm enjoying trying new shit. Let's try it. I don't seem like it, it doesn't seem like I'll like it as much as the uh, junk beam, but whatever. Maybe a lot of faster takedown time.
though, so I can take that section. We are super fucking hurt, though. A uh, fire gun! Three star, though. What else is here first? A rifle crossbow, a throwing axe. Plenty of that. Okay, well, if they're not responsible, then I don't care. Uh, mine. Right, wrenches are good. We know what wrenches are for now. Wrenches are good. We need lots of wrenches. Actually, kind of like that. Let's try that. break again? I don't know. I wasn't paying. I had, I had some kind of up thing, update pop up, but I wasn't paying attention. It's a little known game. I don't see anyone else playing. Um, but it's a lot of fun. It's on uh, the thing. You know the thing? Game Pass. That's what's called. It's insanely fun, dude. It's just, it's a, uh, what's it called? Give me a second. I'll get you. It's an FPS. 
Rogue White. <laughs> Where you control a giant robot and you unlock giant other robots as you go through. But it's just it's Hey, the field steel, look at that. It's um Imagine Doom taken into a modern Doom taken into a modern uh flight style. That's kinda because it's that kind of fast frenetic gameplay where you're just constantly moving, you're constantly blasting, you know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's a lot of fun. And, like, I looked at Twitch and no one was playing it, and that made me a little sad. So I wanted to, like, try to get the word out a little bit. Because it is, it is an absolute blast to play, smaller developer. And, uh, Chris Hansen Dateline. <laughs> I like your gamer tag, but I'm gonna say if you ever go to me on stream, they immediately get concerned. That might be something you want to report to somebody. I'm just saying. <laughs> Why are you here? Oh! <laughs> But oh, no, yeah, it's 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 super chill. It's it's got a lot of elements that I relate to, like games like Rogue Legacy. Uh, like I said, it's got the fast frenetic gunplay of Doom. Uh, it's just you can tell the developers took a lot of time and care with it, and it seems like it's a very small team. And uh, I'm a very small streamer, so you know I like supporting small businesses and small streams. We appreciate your support, my friend! Uh, but yeah, my name is Talos Shane. I'm typically a variety streamer. I think I might play this for a while, just because no one's streaming it. I have been playing Starfield, but that's... A, it's a crowded field, and B, the Xbox app keeps messing up on me. But, uh... I'm a variety streamer doing a lot of random shit, including when I wanted to do movie riffs. If you don't know movie riffs... Ah, I got popped! That's me, yeah. If you don't know who Movie Rip is, it's where I watch bad B-rated films on YouTube that are in the public domain and just sit and make fun of them the whole time. Mystery Science Theater 3000 is a good example. Right, like, I love, uh, I'm a huge leftist. So I love Hassan. I get into politics occasionally and stream not very often. I love Hassan, but, like, I would never watch one of Hassan's live stream because, like... I wanted to fucking chat. I can't see what goes on in his fucking chat. You know what I'm saying? Like, crazy, crazy. There's too much going on. It's fun to sit and watch it. Like me and my wife will sit there and watch him. Like we'll have his stream playing while we're cleaning the bedroom, things like that, and then try to pick out shit that's going on in the chat. <laughs> Look at that. No, okay, so the first big streamer I paid any attention to was um, Co Carnage. And Co Carnage, when his stream's blowing up, he'll put on, uh, like, follower only chat or sub only chat. And I never fucking blamed him, because even with that many. I, I still couldn't keep in a, you know, track of what the hell's going on. Um, So it's. It's. Like, amazing to watch uh, Hassan with. 20,000 plus people in a stream and he's just got that shit rolling and he sees fucking everything it's cr that dude is amazing for that if nothing else robot rebooting speed I don't know what, do I have a robot let's do this oh yeah yeah, yeah. so once he is so far in the game which is pretty early you unlock this little hub area just like your bite your bite and while you're out looking around, you'll gather wrenches, which you can see up in the top right there next to my mini-map. You can go over to the upgrade base camp thing. And if you got enough wrenches, dog, you can do all this. Like, weapons have uh, additional chances for an alt fire. as one power set. You know, just different upgrades and whatnot as you go. I like Moist Critical, too. I mean, Charlie's not very political, but I get the distinct feeling if he got more involved in politics, he would, he would lean more left. I mean, it's like center left, but I think he would lean more left, personally. 
I did love watching him call out Sneeko for calling Mag's clips. Because, <laughs> like, I'm pro gun control, so I had no idea what the fuck they were talking about. But, like, just to watch that little bitch get schooled was great. Because, you know, Sneeko is an insecure little bitch. All those alpha male douchebags are insecure little bitches. That's, that's kind of their thing. And their construction. This game is technically early access. It's not fully released yet. Damn it. So it, it is very fun. I would love to get it more noticed and get it more out there because like, I do feel the developers need more. Right, he's such a tool. It was, uh... When I looked at the release date earlier, it was last year, but it's, it's still listed as early release and they still got shit going. But like, I assumed it would have more recognition, honestly. But then I looked at it tonight and I was like, no one's... Because I was going to do... I got my Xbox Game Pass to work again tonight, so I was going to get back into... Uh, space game that I set the name up before that everyone's fucking playing. I, I, yeah, brain fart. Yeah, it happens. Um... But yet, literally no one else on Twitch was playing this game. I'm like, this game's so cool. Let's get people to notice this game. People, people, notice this game. And take my word for it, I suck. You will probably be way better than me. You will just fucking shred shit. You will go in here and you will feel like the biggest pimp because I am ass and I'm doing decent. So like, you will come in here like a motherfucking pro and you will dominate. And you will feel like the biggest. But give these developers some love. Do it. Actually, if someone can look it up on Steam real quick and put it in the chat for me, what the actual cost is, I would appreciate that. I'm playing on a Game Pass, so I have no idea how much this costs. Although, to be fair, I also don't know if it's on Steam. So, you know, help us out that too. Okay, there. Now that I'm not getting shot at. Uh, critical damage. I ring lights attached to my camera. I got that, uh, the Razer camera. So, I close out the stream labs and it just immediately dies. Anyway. Uh, uh, so yeah, al all alpha males, all of them. Perfectly insecure. Bet your ass, if they are an alpha male wannabe, like the fucking fresh and fit guys, or like, uh, what's his dick? The big one that's currently going to, or being investigated for, uh, Andrew Tate. My key light is trying to, like, adjust it to get my green skin. It's not working. Man, I'm trying, all right? Anyway, <laughs> whatever, whatever, it's fine. We got a little haze, it's fine, it's fine. So, uh, anyway, Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate, horrifically, horrifically fucking insecure. That's why they have to talk all this shit about women and whatnot, is because they're so goddamn insecure. If they were secure in who and what they were, they wouldn't be, like, Andrew Tate's whole, uh, thing about... Why do you not like sparkling water? Are you afraid of bubbles? It's because he likes sparkling water and he's aware that that's typically considered a feminine trait. So he has to convince everyone else it's masculine because, God forbid, he'd be associated with something feminine. They are all horribly, horribly insecure. And so they have to blame it on everyone else that they can't get laid or that, you know, a woman might say no to them or anything else. And the, the, like, the worst part is, they got all these kids fucking listening to them. They're all fucking miserable. Every last one of them. I, like, I finally saw the tape video. I knew it was coming. The, the tape video where he talks about how, like, he doesn't even enjoy having sex. It makes him miserable. It's like, yeah, that, that's, that video exists for all of them. Because, like, if you reduce it the way they do, then yeah, that shit's gonna make you fucking miserable, man. It should be about finding a partner and, you know, finding someone you can confide in. But when you're like, don't feel anything and don't let her know you feel anything, like, that's gonna be fucking miserable. Me too, honestly. Um, I am 42, I'll be 43 in December, so I grew up in the 80s. 
which means we didn't have all these these modern terms y'all are growing up with. If those terms existed, I probably would have identified as non-binary, but I've been made fun of throughout my entire life for not liking football, because apparently I'm gay for not liking watch not for not liking watching grown men bend over and sniff each other's asses while wearing spandex. Seems weird to me, but sure. Um Most aspects of masculine culture just do not appeal to me. I'm competitive. I love gaming. I love competing as people in that. But, like, a lot of the other shit just, it just doesn't make sense to me. I've always gotten along better with women. I've made fun of for that, too, which I always thought was hilarious. Like, aren't we all trying to get with the ladies? So, isn't the fact that I get along better with them ladies to my, to my, uh, wouldn't that be good? But no, it's still bad somehow, and it's because, of course, they're all horribly, horribly, horribly fucking uh, insecure, so they have to make themselves feel better by picking on others. That, okay. This is going to sound weird coming from a Twitch streamer, especially someone who so, so totally wants to make it a career. And I do. I love I love Twitch streaming. I love gaming. All gaming. Uh, I'm going to shatter my kneecap for a few years back. Uh, that QR code you see on your screen is for Extra Life for Kids. It was a massive accident that shattered my kneecap and caused my ex-wife to uh, miscarry our first son. So I raised money in his name for Extra Life for Kids. But, uh... Since I shattered my kneecap, I won't play football. My doctor said I should be fine, but fucking risking it. That's just dumb. Um, but, like, yeah, I love I love to play sports. Even if it's a sport I'm bad at, I love to play sports. I do not like watching sports. And I feel that way a little bit with Twitch. Like, I had a buddy who would watch uh, Halo streams. We were both huge in a Halo time. And, like, I could watch a tournament and watch an engine pull off some pro-level plays and appreciate those plays. But watching like a full long term, th- it bores me to tears. I don't, I don't get it. I like streaming. I like. I, I'm also. Uh, I got a little bit of the tism. Me and my wife have been watching videos. Neither one of us is diagnosed. We're both pretty sure we got a little bit of the tism, and I'm also a little bit sociopathic. So like, I don't like people in person. But stream allows me to be myself and make interactions and jokes and have fun, and I like this kind of connection. But like. While I love streaming, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't like watching people. I like to game. I don't like, I like to play football. I don't like to watch football. I like to play baseball. I will kill myself for a watch baseball game. It's so goddamn boring. I'll see. Aw, thanks. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I've, I've been streaming for Extra Life for years. I love Extra Life. Uh, I started going to, it was two years ago, was the first ELU they invited me to. And now I, I try to, like, there's been, I've been really depressed lately. We're very bad financially. Things are going to hell. It, like, it doesn't matter. Ignore my sob story. Point is, there have been times where I've been like, maybe I should quit streaming. But A, I love doing it. And B, I want to go to ELU next year. So bad. I love ELU. Especially... Got. I'm a freak. If I had more money, I would dress differently. I'm a freak. I love goofy ass outfits. I lo- mostly I love gothic outfits, like old school 16th century gothic. But like I've also got uh, a pirate shirt, big frilly red shirt with the, the frilly cuffs, and I got a beautiful pirate jacket from a company. I'm gonna shout them out right now. Uh, get your princess out. They're an amazing company. It's in St. Augustine, Florida, one of my favorite places to vacation. If you hate spending time in stream at all, you will hear a lot about St. Augustine, Florida. But the website is, I think it's dresslikeapirate.com. It's a very simple website, but I, there's two people at ELU that also dress like pirates. They're more committed to it though. Their entire uh, Discord, or sorry, their entire Twitch personas are based after it. But so I messaged one of them because he loved my code. Let me find that. Dresslikeapirate.com works, but that one is meh. It's it, it's a jank website. Go to 
www.pirate4.life. It's a pirate shop in uh it's a pirate shop in St. Augustine, Florida, where like they go to local artisans and they like have handcrafted weapons, they've leather crafted sheets. I've got this big, beautiful pirate coat. It's absolutely sexy. I love it, but it was made by a local artisan up there in St. Augustine. Fucking gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous crafts. I forget why I got on the subject. <laughs> but, like, yeah, that's part of why I love Extra Life, is seeing, like, the weirdos. Like, I'm walking around in this pirate coat, my pirate shirt, and, like, oh, there's other weirdos like me. There's Captain Rosebeard is the one. I was watching a stream earlier tonight. I say watching a stream. I had it playing. I couldn't hear anything it was saying because I was doing my nails and I forgot to put my headphones on first. So. Bye, bad. <laughs> also, I just looked down and that's Maestro Life Dice. I love Maestro Life Dice. Also, one day, if I ever find the free time, I gotta finish my... I was doing a set of Extra Life uh, Space Marines for Warhammer. I was gonna sell for Extra Life donations. Of course, I also have... I don't actually play Warhammer. I just discovered I really like painting the miniatures. I also have my, uh, my evil Talos-coated Necron army that I've been building. Black and red zims my colors, baby! Thank you, appreciate it. That is... I... I don't... I don't like the world. I'd say... I'd say I don't like the world. Because I am not a capitalist, and I don't believe in... I'm, I'm an artist. I like to just create things. Uh, lately, me and my wife are both giant nerds, and so, like, we do a lot, like, our, our favorite idea of a date night is going to an escape room, just the two of us, and trying to conquer, like, that's, that's fucking heaven for us, you know what I'm saying? And we live in Orlando, uh, of course, everyone knows about, you know, Disney and Universal, the typical Orlando shit, but there's a place called I Drive in Orlando, International Drive. Which is where tourist traps are born. My god, dude. Can I tell you how much I love tourist traps? But there are so many great, 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 just absolutely phenomenal uh, escape rooms out on iDrive. And so now my thing is like designing escape rooms. And, you know, I'm poor, so I can't afford to actually build an escape room. But, like, what I would love to do if I had infinite money is just build a massive old school oh, 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 thank you for follow someone follow Chris Chris thank you for follow um I would love to build like a huge goth haunted house style hotel I'm a fucking wreck dude um and fill it like intersperse it between hotel rooms and escape rooms and have like a section on the ground floor for artists to show off their shit and we would sell it for them no commission or anything, like, they were letting us display their art for free until it got sold, so, like, you know, that's so that commission. It adds atmosphere, it adds ambiance, be fair to everybody. And then once the, uh, the hotel was up and running, and we, we had a crew in place that loved it, and were very happy with their jobs, I uh, would turn that shit over and make it work as well. Again, massive fucking leftist. I just, I just wanted to design escape rooms. I think it's fun. Uh, people I work with, I, I deliver pieces for a living. People I work with started questioning it, and I started divining, des divining, designing an escape room based after a pizza parlor. It sounds fun. I need to like actually write it out. <laughs> well, thanks, Chris, for stopping by. I appreciate it, and thank you for the follow. Florida is largely. Trap. There's a lot of, like, they say we're red state, we're not. We're purple as fuck. But, uh, it's, it's electoral college shit. Uh, the, there's a lot of rural sections of Florida that are more farming territory and whatnot. Those are the red sections. Uh, 
want to be more habitable sides are all blue, and those tend to be either tourist traps or, or to run the gamut, tourist traps or college players. Orlando is flat ass tourist trap. Flat, oh yeah, dude I, dude, I can't even, dude, I can't even tell you how much I love escape rooms. That is my fucking jam. That is, I would love to spend. Part of my problem with capitalism is like, I can't imagine dedicating myself to any one field of study for any period of time. I like doing new things. But like, I would love to do escape rooms for like a solid year or two and then go off and do other shit. And then after I'm done doing my other shit, come back and do more escape rooms. But that's just kind of who I am. But dude, we have so many great escape rooms. Um, if you're if you're doing ALU streams, which Stream Fresh Live 2, yeah. So if you get invited to ELU next year, uh, and you have any free time, and ELU next year, from what I understand, it's already been announced to be at the Dolphin Hotel, which is out by Disney. Uh, if you're if you've got the extra cash and you're willing to Uber, you can go out to High Drive. There is. I'll, I'll give you some names real quick, so get ready. Uh, <laughs> give me a second, because I'm about to pop. So I'm gonna try to. You get a chance to get a pencil ready while I'm trying not to die. Let's see how it works out. Loadout unlocked! Commando! Uh, okay. Uh, the Bureau is one that me and my wife just went to. Uh, that's the latest one we've been to. The Bureau is... Interesting. Thunder. Eh, it's new. Oh, Thumper. That was Thunder. Ah, eh, whatever. We'll try it out. Let's see what it is. Um, the Bureau is one we just recently went to. Uh, they got some great YouTube videos up in their rooms. But the Bureau is... They do more tech for their escape rooms, so there's no, there's no, like, locks or keys or anything like that. It's more, like, buttons and... One of my favorite... One of my favorite in the room we did was we were testing our stealth scales. So we opened a cupboard and there's this big-ass fucking steel chain. And attached to that chain was a special, uh, a cowbell, and a tambourine. <laughs> so we had to take... An, oh, at the very end of that was a, a RFID card. So we had to scan the RFID card in one room. And then quietly try to move it into the other room and scan it in order to pass without setting off a noise sensor. So, Bureau's, Bureau's great. Uh, there's another one on iDrive called... Crap, what are you calling? Uh, I don't remember the name of it offhand, but if you look up, like, uh... Playground Escape Room, that'll probably give it to you. I... I want to say it's the, the escape effect. The playground was dope. It was super easy, but it was also just incredibly fun. It's you're in elementary school class, and you want to compete in a dodgeball competition, but you have to do your homework first. So you're in a classroom, and you have to go out onto the playground and do your homework. It, it's fucking dope. And at one point, they unlocked a slide, and I'm a grown-ass man who doesn't get the opportunity to go down slides very often. So you let me go down a slide. That's an automatic plus one to your escape room. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm that easy to please. I, I, sorry, it was fun as shit. It was really good. Oh, I, I highly recommend. I highly recommend. They're so, they're... Even the bad escape rooms tint with a couple... I've done a couple of bad ones where I was like, ah, eh, this is just irritating. But even the bad ones tend to be at least a little fun. You know what I'm saying? I, I highly recommend. I love escape rooms. Um, I'm spoiled because I'm here in Orlando where we have them all over the goddamn place. I don't know how, how it is for other parts of the country. But... Like, we have them every... Most of them are on my drive, I'm gonna be honest. But... You literally... If you, get, if you go to ELU next year, and you take a day to go out to iDrive before you go home, you could literally plan out a day and schedule it with the escape rooms. Where you do a pub crawl, but instead of getting drunk, you're just going from escape room to escape room to escape room down iDrive. Just walk to them. <laughs> so, I'm a little spoiled, and most of them are fucking amazing. Uh, there's one here called The Collector that is my favorite. 
It's the first one we did, and I, I I forgot where it was. I just found it recently. But it's my first one and my favorite one. The, the plot is like you have that one rowdy friend who's always getting you into trouble, and he convinces you all to go out. And he got you kidnapped by a serial killer. So you're in the serial killer's house trying to escape, and like one of the rooms is literally you playing with the fucking corpse of one of his victims. That shit was dope as fuck, dude. Literally part of the puzzle was taking finding an eye and sticking in the socket of the fucking corpse. And like there's an RFID There's an RFID tag on the bottom of the eyeball and in the sockets when he stuck it in it activated a projector. Dude, it was so fucking cool. <laughs> it was dope as shit. I cannot recommend it enough. The one that has the playground had, you, you can look them up online, they are very prolific. They have a room called Prison Break, and they have rooms across the U.S., so like, and I want to say St. Louis, the Prison Break room has a, uh, has a, uh, the Prison Break is themed after Alcatraz, like the, the cells designed after Alcatraz and all that. So like, you can look them up. Uh, prison Break I did not care for, but that's because our room was actually broken. I'm a little salty about it. But they are very advanced. They have some really cool puzzles. I enjoyed them too. Good, man. Thank you for stopping by. And I appreciate the shit out of the raid, dude. Appreciate, 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 appreciate. And thank you for the follow. You are a beautiful, beautiful mammal, my friend. Thank you so much. Have a great night. I will see you next time. because we have not left ourselves enough health for that sort of shit. But I would like to see it, you know? That'd be our second boss. Oh, fuck, we're in wrecked. What the hell's that? Oh, we don't have the decoy thing. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. We don't have the decoy thing this time. Break in progress. Uh, I can't thank you guys for watching the ads. Well, I can't thank you for watching the ads, but you can't see me, but rest assured, I appreciate you watching the ads. Knocked out. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's, let's... You can hear me, and you wonder why I just got quiet. It's simply because I remember most of you are on ad break and can't hear a fucking word I'm saying, and, like, it seems a waste of time just to, like, fucking talk to myself, you know what I'm saying? So, like... Wait. I'm waiting until everybody gets back. Commando... Let's see, what is yours? Base camp level 4, so working on that. Rocket fires an explosive rocket dealing 80 damage. Shorty fires a shotgun blasting with 60 damage. Check him out. Fuck it. We got a new guy. We got a new guy. We might as well check him out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all you know saying? Y'all you know saying? Everybody knows I'm saying. Y'all you know saying? Y'all you know saying? I'm waiting for the. This is kind of a dick move. I'm waiting for the the ad break to end so you can all get back so you can hear me say that, dude. I really got. 
So I'm going to fucking dip. <laughs> I'm going to put it on uh, mute real quick. I'm going to go use the restroom. I'll be right back. I'm also going to grab a new drink while I am at it. I want to thank all of you beautiful, 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 beautiful mammals for hanging out with me tonight. Uh, I do appreciate it. We are in a very bad way financially, but just hanging out here, you are watching ads and those ads ads benefit me and help me and that is how i prefer to make my money because that's making money off of jeff bezos's bitch ass um i prefer to i prefer on my stream for anyone who's got the i mean we really need the money right now so if you want to donate donate but i prefer on a typical basis for anyone who wants to donate to donate to extra life for kids you can follow that qr code right over there or click on the dangly down there bits. There's a flaming link for next, for the charity streams. Um, either way, whatever whatever works for you, whatever you feel good with. I prefer to make my money off of Amazon Prime subbies or just y'all hanging out and watching them there addies because that drinks money out of Senor Bezos, who is a massive cock-stained piece of shit. I hate billionaires. Fuck that motherfucker. And we still make money for the kids. That's how I prefer to do things, personally. Personally. And I would like to make $1,000 by the end of the year. Upstream, of course. I can. Right, right, it's right below the mouse. You see it. You see it. You see it. I would like to make $1,000 by the end of the year. $80, that is, by the way, from an ELU win. That's right. I won $80 to ELU playing Sushi Go Party. Because I've played it with my kids a few times. So, so I knew how. Yeah. All the video games we played. We played, uh, this year we played, uh, that game, this dumb one, <laughs> where it's a Fall Guys. We played Fall Guys, uh, but we were on a private network that was laggy as fuck. Like, even the people who won are like, what the fuck? And, uh, we played Spider Heck and Ultimate Chicken Horse, which were both fucking phenomenal. I loved both those games. But I'd never played them a day in my life before ELU. <laughs> I actually made a friend. Uh, her name is... Fuck, I'm going to look her up on Discord real quick so I don't get her name wrong. Because she is dope as shit. And I recommend you follow her. By real name, of course, I mean her... Blair Bears. Blair Bears... 65 Blair Bears uh me and her bonded over the fact that we were both playing games that we had never fucking heard of before like we 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 fought each other in the first round of Ultimate Chicken Horse we're like what the fuck is this <laughs> but anyway both great games both great games I both I recommend Spider Heck is actually on Game Pass so you can download it to your PC and play it through the Xbox Games Game Pass app. And then, you know, fight to keep Game Pass working, which is why I haven't played more Starfield, because the Game Pass app sucks. All right. That being said, I've been wasted way too much time. You're all like, dog, I thought you were going to pee so we can get back to the game. Go ahead and pee. So I'm going to go pee real quick, and I'll be back shortly.
back. I am a few ounces lighter. And I am ready to get back to it for a little bit. We're almost at the end of stream. But still, we'll do we'll do one more run through. We'll do one more run through. I'd like to thank uh, Frosty for the raid, you beautiful, beautiful mammal. You are magnificent. Uh, I'd like to thank both Frosty and Chris Hansen Dateline <laughs> for the follows. That fucking name, dog. Anyway, it's been a great night. Thank you all so much for your support. You are beautiful, beautiful creatures. Kramer. Yeah, fuck it, let's try that. Uh, and yeah, let's uh, let's make this last run through a good one, huh? Yeah, make it 12 more. 12 more what? I, I 12 more follows? I fucking wish. What are we doing about? Need 12 more hours. That shit ain't gonna happen unless we start getting more viewers. I will. I will stay alive with more viewers. I am a whore. Also, I'm poor as fuck and in danger of so much bad things happening. So, like, you know that ad rev. That ad rev will keep me up. I will stay up. Likes to be mad, and I'll be like, honey, I have to. I don't have a choice. Some will say it. I do not remember which way we need to go though. Is it right? Okay. Left. Clearly. We have 12 more follows. I think I can stay up until fucking 9 in the morning. I'll get that. That entirely depends on Twitch's ass. Twitch, do you want to give me them there, viewers? Good viewers, you want to hang out with me? It's all up to y'all. Right, switch max. I don't, I don't know what this means though. Light machine gun, we'll take that over the Kramer. The Kramer was pretty fun though. There we go. Uh, we're gonna go back to the ruins. Try to keep that. Twelve more what? That's that Eric player.
Okay, ow. Why is my shotgun or my sniper periodically double shotting? It doesn't seem like something I'm doing wrong. It seems like. There's like a feature of the gun that I'm not understanding. Maybe it's every so many shots and double shots. It seems likely, right? Be. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I was looking at my fucking stats and trying to figure out what my next commercial break was. Thank you all for watching. I do appreciate you, especially if you're watching ads. I need them ads, revs, and I greatly, greatly appreciate it. Remember, remember, consider scanning that their QR code or clicking the flaming link in the dangly down there best to contribute to Extra Life for Kids, supporting our former children's hospital here in Orlando, Florida. We greatly appreciate that. Or you could just donate to me, and like, I would greatly appreciate that because I really need the money. Uh, I, I, again, typically don't like that. I typically prefer to go to the kids. I just... It's very right, it's fine. But, like, you know. This time's gonna be a good time. I have a feeling like it's not, but, like, I'll take your word for it, dog. Okay, so I'm just gonna fucking fuck around and have fun. Uh, a lot of weird ricochet shots, I like it. I need to check my weapons. Too much fucking health in that round. Back to the starter robot, actually. I think I like that one the best because I understand it the best. Oh, sorry, Sig. That might have just jumped my batteries. Alright, so yeah. Part is a shotgun blast. I lied. One more. <laughs> Shut up, you ain't surprised. Ooh, such naughty bots. Chain sir. Chainsaw is high damage, unfortunately it requires us to be like right up in their bitch, in their shit, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> I would also greatly appreciate word of mouth, but that is the best advertising we'll go for if you tell your friends, yo, this tell us to do pretty dope. Out tomorrow at 9 30 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, we probably will not be at the computer, we'll probably be at the PS5 because Lex is off the Lex is my wife. And she has to use a whole computer for yelling. Works up. So, uh, we'll probably be at the PS5. Uh, we might do a kart racer game or we might get back to. Uh, But, you know, you can shout up on threads or just, you know, whisper me on Twitch to vote, whichever one you want. I am very manipulable. I listen to my viewers. Either way, if you have a preference, let me know, and I will take that into consideration tomorrow! Oh, wow. 
Okay, power itself. What the fuck? Oh, oh, I had to pick. Fuck, I didn't even look at the weapon. I thought I could pick up both. God damn it. Ah, uh, well, whatever. Alright, so it looks like the ultimate fire is like a shotgun blast. Slap! Oh, well, this viewer's done! I suck! Why don't you love me? Please love me! Maybe I'm just bad at this. Maybe I should just, just... Maybe I should just quit. Should I quit? I should probably just quit. Go ahead and click that tip button down below. To. Uh, I also don't care, so. My titties, my titties, my titties. Just gonna slap my tit and it hurts. That one, I guess. I don't fucking care. Whatever. It doesn't matter. We're gonna die soon, and then I'm gonna go to bed. So it doesn't matter. Uh, oh, yeah. Fuck it. Hey, fuck. We got a triple shotgun. It's, it's like three shotguns in one, bitch. Oh, well, that one actually cost me money. I shouldn't have fucking... <laughs> ah. Uh, Sheriff's Carbine. Because it's all sheriffical. It's all sheriffical. You know, ACAB, so I probably shouldn't have bought it, but whatever.
can't tell what the fuck's going on. I'm kind of operating on pure fucking reflex here. So if I'm doing good, I'm not going to take entire credit for that because, like, it's me, but it's not really me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not focused or anything. I'm just fucking, like, my, my body is towards its own zone. Okay, we're 69 cent of shield covered. Woo! Fell in the U. Wow, we cleared it with like no fucking help, so that's fun. I'm sorry that you had to die, my friend, but twas for my glory. He hopes you can appreciate such things. So some kind of like health thing associated with them, they don't. Twelve more what? What the fuck are we talking about, Dip? God damn it, you left that shit hanging. Fuck you! It's about to start. Well, we can't quit for the ad. We need the ad revenue. And I really want this. I really want Dip to explain twelve more what. And she's just not. She's not doing it. She's not doing it, y'all. She's letting us down. She's letting us down, Dip. I hope you're fucking proud. about that oh hey hey fuck you with <laughs> your hey hey shit asshole i knew you were fucking doing this shit on purpose
Uh, Scout Sniper, Mine Gun, Blast SMG, Pumping Shotgun, girl, I'll pump your shotgun. Clock around the track. It's lost and lost brains. The graviton launcher. Launcher. All the fucking ads. Watch 10 million ads. Seriously, I need the money. Get a rifle crossbow is not a uh, matter of it's a matter of rate of fire, not a uh, fucking accuracy. Say there's a thing here. It says all stars want a trip to TwitchCon Las Vegas. It's on my fucking uh, stream labs. I want to go to Las Vegas. I mean, I would, but I'd like to go with Lex, and that's not going to happen if I won the TwitchCon thing. So. But some kid who actually cares. I just want to do what I love and make money doing it. I I care about the money. I just want to do what I love and not have to fucking, you know, worry about how I'm going to survive. That's what I should say. Money, unfortunately, is caught up in that.
Ah, uh, probably not, kid. Probably not. I'm pretty slush. so far and I would want it but I, I feel like we did pretty good for that Smiley face on it, I like it. Oh, kitty! Oh, kitty! out of fucking nowhere 12 more nothings okay well fuck you dip for never fucking letting us know what 12 more of what seems like some bullshit seems like you're just being an ass at this point but you know it's fine whatever you want to be an ass you be an ass you do it you do it i think we're gonna play this game uh, well tomorrow night lex is off so we'll be playing some mps5 uh, we will not be doing this game but i think whenever we when lex isn't working and we're we're able to get on PC, I think we're gonna be doing this game because no one, no one streams it, and it's a really good game, and I really like it, and I really want people to pay attention to it. I think it's fucking dope. I think it's fucking dope. I'm gonna post this shit to YouTube and uh, make it available in my fucking things. Uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, we are gonna call it a night. But before we do, as always, I want to thank Dip as our biggest supporter, fucking ever of all time. Uh, Ashley Wolfie is our second biggest supporter of all time. And then Frosty Blustar. 
for the raid, my friend, and the new follow. I do appreciate you, you beautiful bastard. And Chris Hansen Dateline for uh, the follow and the very disturbing name that I want to see go into more shit Twitch trash to see if anyone flips out about it. Be like, why are you here? Uh, I haven't done nothing. Honestly, we probably need that in more Twitch and YouTube chats based on what's come out about various Twitchers in 12 more rounds, you wank. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, no. <laughs> I did two more. That's a world of 10 shot. We'll do, we'll do the other 10 on another, another night. Anyway, thank all of you, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bastards. I love your faces. I will catch you next time. I hope you all have a phenomenal day tomorrow. And until then... Take care of yourselves. Look out for one another. The great day!